your friends, find your enemies and make amends, and we'll meet in the middle. Take Hello, good day to all of you. This is Sweeney Madrisi Flores of Confused Family Dad. And today we're going to talk about why are we working so hard? We are working from one job to another job and to another job. And having side jobs, rackets, and regular jobs. Okay, it is because, especially now that we are having or experiencing pandemic, there are a lot of changes in our lives. And of course, the old bills that we have were added because of this pandemic. Okay, so these are the expenses that we have, especially uh, now in the city. Okay, so of course, because we are, you know, we are storing our storing our food because it is not good to go out and you know buy for daily because we are avoiding and going out regularly so we're having our refrigerator that's why our bills and uh, electric bills soar higher than usual so we have these bills like electric bills water bills and of course we have our internet it is because um this pandemic we're having our online seminars webinars we are having orientations conferences uh, right after our right uh, in our houses or in our homes so we have this internet bills monthly we are also having our online shop so we have this uh, subscription to internet and we also have smart TV that, that's why we are using um, this internet for our YouTube and also we are having hulugan in our appliances like this refrigerator because sometimes uh, kung kailan natapos yung, yung pera saka naman nasira yung ating appliances so we are succumb to hulugan monthly so we have insurances that we are having we are paying like sa AXA ganun, and other insurances that we have in here in the city and also we're having the, the plan like St. Peter of course we have to plan because no one will plan for us and next is of course uh, some small time investments like you know buying a jewelry or etc or something like that and another is a monthly pay for a nanny kasi nga hindi tayo makakapag-alaga ng ating anak kasi may trabaho tayo so we have to hire a yaya or a nanny so that we can so we have a yaya para mapagpatuloy natin yung ating pagkatrabaho na hindi natin isinasama yung mga anak natin sa labas because it is very dangerous especially now in times of pandemic so next is the payments for laborer uh, nagpapatrabaho din tayo um, kasi dito sa Bicol palaging kasama sa bagyo ano? palaging kahate, palaging sako, palaging pinupuntahan binibisit ng bagyo so um, kailangan ay maayos ang bahay um, malayo pa yung bagyo nagpapaayos na nagpaparepair na, nagpapapintura ng mga roof nag ano ba? nagpaayos na ng bubong para kung sakali may maging bagyo and it will always be here present in Bicol region so nagpapaayos so imagine yung araw niya is 500 pesos kung dalawa 1,000 or 1,100 iba pa yung materials so imagine kung hindi tayo magtatrabaho anong ibabayad natin how can we secure life during calamities okay next is we have what's this um 
Payments for vitamins. Ano sa pag-purchase ng mga vitamins like vitamin C and other vitamins na kailangan natin ngayon to have a strong immunity system. And of course, kung nagkakasakit, ano yung mga hospital bills and clinic sa clinic, mga babayan sa ating doktor. Yung gamot natin na reseta, so laboratory. So, part of our expenses na kailangan natin pagtrabahuhan. Uh, kasi kung yung isang yung sakit natin ay may nararamdaman tayong sakit, hindi natin sinanggunin sa doktor at nagsiself, nags ano lang tayo, self-treatment, self-medication, which we do not know if it's right kasi hindi naman natin pinag-aralan yun. So, kailangan natin kumayod para din sa ating health, di ba? Para hindi na lumawa, lumala yung sakit. So, kung sakali mo na magkasakit ay tingnan na agad kung okay di okay. At kung talagang kailangan ng gamutan, at least in the early stage of it, alam na natin. Uh, in the reason yung nagtitipid tayo, ano po, ang importante ay ang ating health. Kapag healthy tayo, we can acquire more money or yes, finances. Maayos natin ang finances natin as long as we are healthy. Next is our pamasahe. Yes, ang ating fare. Uh, it's very expensive or it's very na, rise up na ang ating pamasahe. Dati 8 pesos na 15. Nag 20. So, gusto mong lumabas, hindi ka lalabas. But you know, hindi natin, hindi natin pwedeng sumabi na mahal ang pamasahe, hindi ka kapapasok or hindi ka lalabas. Kasi marami tayong mga appointment, transactions, and businesses na kailangan natin talagang lumabas ng bahay. And sobrang expensive yung pamasahe na kailangan talagang pagtrabahuhan. Hindi ka makakatipig. Kasi walang mangyayari kung hindi ka din lalabas. It's very important to have a budget for um, fair. And next is... Ano ba to? Yes, we have so many expenses na kailangan talaga natin pagkagindan. So, yun ang dahilan why we are working not only at one job at gumagawa pa tayo ng ating mga garden para yung mga ibang bagay hindi na natin bilhin. Kasi kung bibili natin lahat, pagbabayaran natin lahat, walang matitira man lang sa ating sarili. Diba? But, you know, we cannot just stop spending just because we are, you know, we are being thrifty hindi natin yun pwede. We have to spend money para bumalik din sa akin ulit. And of course, I am reminding especially the single parents to be aware of their health. Of their, you know, of their spending also. Hindi yung sa isang bagay ka lang ma -ano, ma dumadami yung gastos mo. For example, sa pagkain, um, yes, pinakahuli sa akin ang pagkain to kapit pala yung pagkain. Kasi, um, Usually, binibili ko lang yung mga murang gulay, 20 pesos per pack, 20 pesos per pack, at bihira kong magkumain ng karne. Ang karne ay 300 pesos per kilo, kulang ko yung kung ang kain talaga. Pero ako, kumakain lang ako ng isang kilo lang, that's enough. At yung gulay, yung fruits, yun ako, dun ako, dun ako bumibili. So, shout out nga pala dito sa aking apron. Apron, actually, apron to. Tamad lang talaga akong magbilis. So, ito apron lang. Then, Imperial, thank you so much for delivering this. Uh, thank you so much at talagang pinutin mo kami dito. Thank you. At hindi na ako nakikinut up. Ang hirap makinut up kasi nga, hindi tayo constrain natin. Uh, pwede natin bilhin pero wala tayong time para pumunta sa video namin. So, thank you so much for watching our video. I hope you learned something and you can share and like this video. See you next time. Bye!